day bike life here with my buddy Ed all the way up there in the front. Ed is a subscriber as mine as you guys probably know by now. And Ed and I are going to meet up with one of my first subscribers, Knights to the End. He's been an hour away from me, but he has been with my channel since the very beginning. So we're taking a hike out there to meet up with him. Dude, those Jewish people love you. They love you, man. Well, yeah, like I was saying, we're going to meet Nice to the End, one of my first subscribers. I only have one GoPro battery with me. I brought a charger, but it doesn't mean anything, being that I can't charge it anywhere on the bike, which sucks. But. At least we'll get to meet nice to the end. I'm gonna stop the video until we get, you know, to his house or to wherever we're meeting him. And then I think we're gonna do like a little ride there also. So. you guys all right guys there he is the one and only nights to the end I drove an hour just to meet him my first subscriber not my first but definitely one of the ones that was there since the beginning of the channel and stayed there until now and later on because now he's gonna be world famous because I'm putting him in a YouTube video but it's almost like I got a little ride going, guys. I got Ed Hall, Knights to the End. He's on a 600 double R Honda. Um, we're out here in Bridgewater. He says he has some sick rides out here for us. We'll probably be here for a couple hours. Uh, one of them was Washington Rock, I believe he said. It is where like George Washington seen the British coming. And then um, another one was something else, but I can't remember what it was. I was gonna say, I don't see nothing on that little pipe. Yeah. So I've never been out this north. But from what I see so far, it, I, I feel like I'm in a mount. Was that a plane? There was like a shadow that just casted right over us. It wasn't a tree and it wasn't a bird, but it wasn't a plane either. But yeah, it, from what I'm seeing so far, just from being here, it seems like all mountains. But it doesn't look like a mountainous terrain. The trees just look tall. But we'll see where Knight's gonna bring me and Ed. Yeah, big shout out to Knight's on the end. Or Knight's to the end. Finally got to meet him. Been talking on Snapchat for like months about meeting up. Been talking on YouTube forever. So it's finally nice to just meet up with him. He's a cool dude. I keep calling him Knight's to the end. His name's Casper, but I don't know why I keep calling him Knight's to the end. That's just how you guys, I guess, would recognize with him, but. So apparently we're heading to an airport and hopefully there's some airplanes flying around that we can get some a real nice footage of. If not, I might cry and go an hour home just to cry. Well, we're at the airport. This is a pretty cool airport. I like how the cockpits are all covered up. It's 
So I guess they don't get hot in there or something. I'm not seeing any planes. What was that? I said I'm not seeing any planes. <laughs> Me either. But sometimes there's planes here taking off. I was gonna say I don't know what. I mean the cars are here, so there's there's gotta be planes in the air, like that guy right there. All right, signal him in. Come on, dude. We want to see a plane landing, world famous YouTube entry with me riding next to it. <laughs> now that would be cool. Dude, that guy's definitely coming in. Oh shit, it's happening. Dude, he's gonna be so nervous when this comes down. I wish I had like a sticker or something to give it to him to let him know like, dude, you're world famous now. I can give him my business card. I got those with me. Here comes the future. I don't know, he's looking swirly. Yeah, called him in. I told, dude, I told him. <laughs> oh, look at that. He's, he's, he's doing all right. So far, so good. Oh, what? Piece of cake. I think a perfect landing is when he gets all three wheels on the ground. At the same? Time. I don't know, I like that little wheelie he did. <laughs> <laughs> was a, World War II movie. Yeah, no, that was a sick wheelie that he did. It's probably like 50 grand used, I don't know, brand new. I don't want a brand new one, I buy everything used. I like, the, oh, this guy's, oh, this guy's sloppy. Look at him. <laughs> All three hit the ground at the same time, though. I'm talking like I know what the hell he's doing. <laughs> <laughs> but this is my dad here. He's coming to pick me up so I can go back home, so. <laughs> Daddy. Yeah, I'm here, Dad, but I'll load the, I'll load the bike up. Like, oh, shit. Full throttle. <laughs> oh, good job. You That's the first time that guy ever got a thumbs up before. That's a sweet. Ford in front of us. I thought it was a Jeep. I was going to call it a Jeep. All the people that have Jeeps probably would have harassed me and called me names. But yeah, everywhere out here where, where Casper's at is like all those little kids love the wave. They need a card. How do I get how do I get them a card? They need one. No. How am I going to get these little kids a card? I got one card almost falling out. And I don't want to take Okay, I'm taking the concentration off the road. Put it back in. Okay, it's in. We're live. So, I wasn't recording, but I gave these guys in front of us a nice spam card. I don't know who they are, they're nice people, that's a Ford Bronco he was saying, I think he said it's a 78, so I'm, I'm glad I didn't call it a Jeep, because it's a Ford. Those kids were so happy to get the card, the dad seems cool. I'm telling you man, these, these spam cards worked out perfect. I don't think there's really anything better than these cards. I think my arm just blocked everything, but I don't care. Look how cool I look in the thing, though. We're going to Washington Rock now. What happened? We're going to Washington Rock. Okay. Yeah. Alright, so now we're going to Washington Rock. I thought we were going there this whole time. I only got two bars of gas. Dun dun dun! Will I run out? Guys, we made it to Washington Rock Road. That means we're almost there at Washington Rock, where George Washington himself saw the British coming, even though he didn't want to be a general. We don't want to go down Glen Eagle. We want to go to Washington's Rock. Dead end, uh-oh. Oh no, just that road.
Dude, all these people probably knew George. That that guy probably is George Washington in that house. That's probably George Washington. That chipmunk. <laughs> Casper almost ran over that chipmunk. Yo, sick Camaro, sick, sick. Yo, what up, guys? Washington Rock. We're here. Yo, is that New York? Closer. I usually see it from Handy Hook. I was gonna say I see it from uh there's like a marina in the Highlands area. Yeah. I was there live under the twin towers. Twin I was there yesterday, the twin lights. The twin lights. Yeah, I could see how you could see a couple red coated men coming this way from here. There was, there was probably no, nah, there was probably no trees because the dinosaurs ate them all, so it was kind of like chill. It was chill out here. There wasn't much really going on. Why, that thing cost quarters? Wow. George Washington would be so upset right now. Where did the British come from? That way? Or that way? From Britain. From Britain, right? Yeah. They landed somewhere along the shore out there somewhere. And then they walked all the way over here. Wow, that would have yeah. Walking like 40 miles. And then they were tired. They got here and they had to climb up this stupid rock just to get the J. W. Washington Jr. the third. Dude. Thank you. Good meeting you, man. Thank you for coming so uh, far. Next time I'll go to your place. All right. Yeah, that sounds good. <laughs> I was gonna say it wasn't that bad, dude. It was like a straight stretch, so it wasn't bad at all. Okay, that's good. But I'll see. Let me know on the date, I mean, on the time of that, so I can set it up. I'll make a video like tomorrow or something about it. All right, I'll let you know today. Okay, cool. Well, we're done at Washington Rock. Me and Ed just got done hanging out with Knights to the End, aka Casper. We got about an hour road trip home. Dude, the roads that they have out here by him are amazing. If I was him, I'd be out on the bike like every single hour of the day just to drive these roads. They're, they're not like too special of roads, but they're like amazing roads. They're desolate, they're paved, there's not much traffic. All the houses are like beautiful out here. The grass is all nice, <laughs> if that means anything. The um. The people drive all right out here. I never had an issue with a car coming over or anything like that. So, if you guys ever get a chance, man, come out to Bridgewater area. But definitely had a good time riding with Knights to the End. If you guys want to check out his channel, I'll leave his channel in the description. <laughs> I'll leave his channel in the description. What is this, a cul-de-sac? You lost! <laughs> but, alright guys, we're gonna start the commute home. Thanks Casper for showing me all these sick roads. Had a blast. I'll definitely come down again, and you'll have to come down by me. And we'll get something working. Later guys.